Gentlemen, welcome back to the show. I'd like to thank my special guest, Dr. Matt Eschelbach, uh, a real-life ER doctor who has a very interesting hobby. <laughs> As you know, Dr. Matt collects an interesting group of knuckleheads he calls patients, <laughs> and uh, but other people might call the Darwin Award candidates. Uh, now, Dr. Eschelbach has comprised a top 10 list of things that would put you at risk for becoming a Darwin Award. Now remember, if it weren't for the heroic efforts of uh, paramedics, ER doctors, and nurses um, everywhere preventing these folks from actually removing themselves from the shallow end of the gene pool, <laughs> uh, they might be heading to the morgue instead of back home. Uh, so what I am told is that the more of these risk factors that you actually combine, Ladies and gentlemen, the better chance it is that you will seriously hurt yourself. <laughs> and that's the way you'll end up back in Dr. Matt's ER. So here we go, ladies and gentlemen, with the top 10, uh, Dr. Matt's top 10 Darwin Award risk factors. <laughs> here we go. Number 10, alcohol ingestion. Well, as I like to call it, drinking like a sailor. <laughs> oh, not a very smart thing to do. And number nine, use of drugs. Any drugs, it's, it's just plain dumb, so I don't you think? Uh, number eight, playing patty cake with snakes. <laughs> well, someone's gonna get bit, don't you think, at one time? Uh, number seven, uh, anything to do with firearms and or guns, uh, especially with the safety off. Yeah. <laughs> with the, number six, playing with exploding things. If it goes boom, you're doomed. <laughs> you go. Number five, playing with fire. Uh, think about fire, uh, ladies and gentlemen, is that it's hot. Yeah, okay, you're gonna get burned eventually. And number four, cars, trucks, and motorcycles. You know, doing wild, crazy stuff, uh, especially at the same time. <laughs> uh, number three, playing with any moving thing on wheels. Well, like sticking your hand in bicycle spots. You know, that's just not smart. Uh, <laughs> uh, number two, having a history of hanging out in the Gray Bar Hotel. That's jail, folks. Uh, uh, you know, jail, folks. The Gray Bar Hotel. And the number one risk factor for the Darwin Award is being a male and not really knowing it. I don't know what that means, but there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much. And now, back to Dr. Matt. Here we go. Here we go. 